Hi, this is Angela Murad at Amazing Kids AAC Consulting. Always love thinking of new ways to use AAC out of the box. And here in TD Snap Motor Plan 66, in the dashboard, there's a whiteboard. And I imported this cool new free worksheet from NeuroWild um, that goes with one of their resources, cropped it down to fit it here. And you can add more than one image. I don't think I had realized that before. And I have other ones where I just imported a single image, but you can actually import several images into your whiteboard. So pick a photo, and then you just resize it. And whoops, let me go back into edit, and then move it where you want it. So if I wanted to um, complete this worksheet um, using their AAC, we could take screenshots from within the app, crop them down, even use the new web search tool that I demoed yesterday. Go find that video um, and then watch what you can do. So this one's about me, things I'm good at. Um, I really am good at thinking outside of the box. I very rarely use AAC for just AAC. I use a combination of lots of things in very creative ways. Um, stuff that I like. Whoops, let me erase that. I'm going to go into Edit Images, and then I can drag this one to where I want it. I like being creative. Things that feel hard to me, I don't do well with large crowds at all. Nope, not for me. Uh, things that smell horrible. Apologize for anyone who loves these, but oh my goodness, Brussels sprouts make me nauseous. The smell of them just, oh, no. <laughs> not doing it. Um, things that make learning hard for me are if it's a very noisy environment with lots of things going on in the background, that's pretty hard for me. Um, things that help me learn, and probably no surprise here, video instructions, it's why you see me make so many of these videos. It's the way that I prefer to learn, and so I like nice, simple, to the point videos. Things that have a nice smell to me. I love the smell and taste of my vanilla caramel latte every morning. And then I tap out of it. And if I want to draw here, you can draw. So yeah, and then whenever I go out and come back, it's saved. Um, I can add a new whiteboard. I can go back to a previously saved one. If I want to erase what I've drawn, I tap Erase. If you do tap Clear, it will clear out the whole thing. So um, these aren't necessarily permanently saved. Um, if you wanted to save what you've created, then you could go in and take a screenshot. Oh, I can see that somehow things went behind. So... Let me go over here, and I'm going to move this way out of the way, and you can see how you can resize them. I'm going to move them back over here to the side. So it's not perfect. I have a, a vision board app that is actually easier to do this on, but that's not within an AAC app. So it can be a little tricky, and so you may have users that may need a little help doing this, but I thought it was a pretty cool option to be able to do. Okay, so now I can drag this one back over where I want it. And I'm gonna put my vanilla caramel latte, things that smell good, think outside the box, back up here, stuff that I like, being Creative. My video instructions are things that help me. I don't do well when it's really crowded and noisy. 
horrible smell to me is Brussels sprouts and things that make learning hard if there's a lot of competing noise in the background. Anyway, just an idea of another way that you could use the whiteboard area in TD Snap.